This is a continuation of the topic that I started a um, couple of days back. It's got to do about the process that um, it takes for you to make sales online when you're marketing online. Yeah. I've been talking about how to build a funnel. That is the process people go through to, to end up as your customers. So that's what I've been talking about the old cop this this whole week. So if you want to follow up, I will also encourage you to watch the previous videos for the past days. Then it's easier for you to follow up um, this series. Yeah. And also, if you are very new here, I would love for you to say your name and where you come from down at the comment section. I would love to greet you personally. I want to take this opportunity to greet you and as well to get connected to you yeah so and also if you are watching the replay later i would also love for you to do the same if i've not taken this opportunity um or if we have not um get connected yet i would love to know you as well mm? so you know um the thing is what you know when i came into this industry one thing that i've been learning since i started in this industry um online industry because i started with network marketing and that's what's led me to market online so i came to realize that um, my target market is me hmm? because that's what i've been hearing a lot of successful marketers online they have been this they have been talking a lot that your target market is you they said one so when you come into this industry you have to look at yourself when you pick a company, look at yourself when you pick a company and ask yourself, why did you pick that company, that particular company, whether it's an internet um, network marketing or maybe any other company or business that you're doing? Why did you choose that particular company or business? Mm? So if you're involved, for example, in network marketing, why did you get involved in the network marketing company you are in? What do you love about the product of this company? How did this product change your life? Mm? You know, that's why when you get into um, a network marketing business, the company encourages you to create a product story and a money story. They encourages you to do that, to create a story, what the product did for you. So now when you create that, so now um, you have a story of how the product has changed your life. Yeah. And because of your story, you are not like just pitching your product here and there to everybody. But you, you, you have what the product has done for you. You have the story to tell people that this is what this product did for me. And I'm sure, 100% sure, this product can do the same for you. Yeah. So maybe um, when you come into this industry, it wasn't because of money problem. Maybe you just didn't have time for your children. You want time freedom or maybe you hate uh, the alarm clock in the morning. You hate getting up in the morning, maybe going to work and maybe you hate. You don't like um, when someone tell you, when to come to work and when to um, go from work yeah and maybe you also hate short vacation you like when going to go, going on vacation you like going on a long vacation yeah maybe three weeks four weeks or whatever you want to have that nice time yeah and maybe you don't um maybe you you don't only get into this business or into your company um, or your job because of the money but you get into it because maybe you just want to take care of your family that's why you you're working a, a regular job but you really don't like to work for somebody else maybe you are that type of person yeah and find later on you change that you don't want to work for somebody else but you choose to do your own business and maybe then you choose a network marketing company so why did you choose the network marketing company and all those things that I've just um, I've been saying? Maybe this would be one of the reasons why you choose this ne network marketing company. And then you become your, your segment market or your target market because of 
what you wanted in this product what you were looking for so this your own story would be the people that you will be looking for hmm? so um <clears throat> so you get so you have to get clear about who you are who you are why you choose this company so why did you get started in this company in this business in the first place yeah and and a lot of time you will find out that you are your target market when you go through your reasons why you start into this company and your story behind what you get or the solution you get from this um, company so now that you have identified whom you are talking to through um, through like a, finding out about yourself and why you joined the company then you have already like find out whom you are talking to yeah and you want to you will want to create a lead magnet you want to create a magnet the lead magnet you know like a magnet like this too high on you have like a negative and positive when you try to put them together you see the forces both of them pull and they they connect to each other so it's almost like the same thing this lead magnet do that we have been talking about yesterday i showed us a, um, a, a picture or a diagram about the lead magnet you can watch yesterday um, live you will see exactly what um, it is like yeah so what is this lead magnet well a, this a lead magnet is an irresistible bribe offering a specific value to a prospect in exchange for their contact information mm? so this lead magnet is supposed to be irresistible and it's supposed to be a specific value to a prospect the prospect that is the person you are marketing to yeah and it has to be in exchange for their information that is what this whole magnet this thing entails it's supposed to have all those things in it yeah so the prospect lead magnet will offer tremendous values within five minutes of the opt-in. So you want to put information there that you know within five minutes, this person can give you the information in exchange for the value you, have, you are giving them. Hmm? So you simply need to solve a specific problem with a specific solution for a specific segment market. Hmm? So it has to be specific, very, very specific. You can't be general. You can't talk to everybody. You have to be specific, yeah? It's very important. Because when someone read what it says, of course, in, if that person has that problem, they know exactly that you are talking directly to them, yeah? That will prompt them to move and make the action, yeah? So it shouldn't be, it's, it's not like a something that should be updated it has to be because people don't like something updated they have they want recent recent um, information yeah they want a value driven content that is what people want yeah so it has to be specific to the problem and a solution you know and you know especially on facebook there are so much noise going on there are things moving and things going so people automatically have a lot going on on Facebook. Mm? So, you, so your lead magnet should be, for example, are you struggling with such and such? If it's weight loss, for example, are you struggling with weight loss? So you've already from there been specific. Mm? Because if a, someone is not struggling with that, they, it will not attract them. But if someone is struggling with that, you've already get their attention, yeah? That is the magnet, yeah? So, um, so your lead magnet um, got to speak to the people the, or the person that you are directing or that you are marketing to, yeah? So you have to decide which problem that lead magnet will solve. Mm? because we have a lot of problem but you have to pick a specific problem which you will focus on yeah so then you write down or you write out um, your customer avatar and their problem yesterday i also described i gave an example of your a customer avatar yeah and you're gonna make a decision 
on which problem this lead magnet is going to solve yeah so you are going to try to solve you're not going to try to solve all of their problems in one lead magnet you're not going to solve all of their problem so you're just going to choose one problem a specific problem for one lead magnet yeah to solve for uh, for the people that you are marketing to so you have to remember you are your target market yeah you have to remember your target market yeah which yesterday i said we described uh i gave example of a lady i described yesterday just to give you the understanding yeah so i said this lady she was um she wants to lose weight for a wedding she's going to have a wedding so she wants to lose weight but she don't want to she don't like going to the gym mm -hmm. she wants to lose weight but she didn't like going to the to the gym and she wants to work at home she wants to work out at home yeah and she wants more energy and she wants to reduce her sugar craving because she like a lot of sugar and we know when we use a lot of sugar the effect it has on our body and she wants to reduce her sugar cravings and she also wants to have children she don't have children but she wants to have children and she wants to travel a lot Mm? and for example because she wants to travel a lot you can for example tell her how she can travel more mm? so now you will decide which of these problems you want um, your lead magnet to solve she have all these different different problems you cannot focus on all of them at the same time but you can just choose one for one lead magnet you will focus on and you can choose another one you have a specific lead magnets as well that focus on a specific problem and you have a specific solution to that um to that problem yeah so you have to be very very specific if it's for the travel good evening rachel how are you you're welcome this evening how is the family doing yeah so you have to if it's uh the weight loss you have to show her how she can lose weight within maybe um a, maybe two weeks for example how she can lose x amount of weight within x amount of time so then you have been specific then you have to give exactly step by step what she needs to do or if she wants more energy you have to give a specific step by step solution or about sugar if that's what you want to focus on how she can reduce a sugar cravings you have also have to give a specific you're welcome you're welcome rachel you also have to give a specific um, step by step solution as well or if it's the traveling you also do the same thing as well yeah so now you will decide now that you have you know a problem and you have a solution so you will decide which of these problems you want your lead magnet to solve yeah and then you want to ask yourself what type of lead magnet will you want to give her hmm? what type of lead magnet you want to give her so now let's talk about the type of lead magnet you could create for this lady the example i gave yesterday and that i've also just talked about today yeah and ha and now you have your your business opportunity you can also use this lead magnet for your company as well yeah so if you are a small business um, owner you can also use this lead magnet to attract your customer yeah and this lead magnet well every um, company have different different solutions or different um, business they have and they have different people they are focusing on but the method of this lead magnet is exactly the same for all business yeah it's exactly the same so um so this work for any type of company yeah it doesn't matter whether you are in um which type of business you have yeah whether you have small business or big business is the same thing but as long as you want to generate leads online yeah this is the way you got to do it so this is the way um successful people have been using as well to develop their business online yeah to give information to people that are struggling with certain things yeah 
So the lead magnet, the type of lead magnet you can create, for example, you can do a PDF or a free report. You can do a video training or video tutorial, you know, like a short video, a short video course. Maybe you can do three short video courses, um, you know, because not everybody likes to stay long watching videos or whatever. So you have to make that, make sure that it's short, which will help them to or move them to want to watch it to the end. Yeah. So you do it very short, showing them step by step how you can solve this um, this problem. So that's videos or the PDF supposed to have the solution to their problem. Or maybe you can also do a webinar replay. Hmm? Or you can also do an um, audio file that they can download from iTunes or from or listen from a podcast. Yeah. And you can also give a give away a checklist on what they can do a checklist on that or maybe you can also give ebook a 10 page or 15 pages ebook you go straight to the point exactly the solution how they can do or solve this problem a step-by-step -step solution yeah or you can also give them a swipe um, copy, a swipe um, file. Because you know a lot of people, they like shortcuts. They want something that can work very, very fast. So you want to give them something that you know they can get fast to their journey. Yeah? And the thing is, people know exactly what they want, um, what, what they are going to get when. They are, when you are speaking to them, to a specific people, yeah? So when they see this information, they know exactly what they are going to get because you've already put there what this lead magnet is all about and what is inside this thing, the lead magnet. The lead magnet is supposed to put the link of the video or maybe the PDF or the ebook or whatever you choose, which type of lead magnet you choose to give them yeah it's supposed to have it there the link so when they click on that link then they give you the information then they get this value from you that they can download or maybe listen to yeah so this is how you create your lead magnet mm? yesterday i showed you a picture of it then um, but tomorrow i will try to find out again if i can show you as well i didn't bring it up today Good evening, Donuts. How are you this evening? You're very welcome, dear. Yesterday I showed you how you can do it as well. Good evening, Claudia. How are you this evening? How was your Thursday today? You're very, you're very welcome. Thank you. Thank you for the like. So that's how you create your lead magnet. So it doesn't matter. Oh, good evening, Nadia. How are you, sweetie? How are you this evening? You are very welcome. So you didn't miss it. You are, I'm almost rounding up now. How are you? How are you, Nadia? I hope you're doing. I hope you're doing okay. Oh, Donut, Donut. How are the kids doing as well? Good evening, Elino. Good evening, all of you. How are you doing? Thank you, Elino. You are very, very welcome this evening. How is your mom as well? Tell her it's long time I've not been seeing her. Oh, okay, well, Nadia, I will join you immediately because I don't have long time again. Then definitely I'm going to join you. Yeah? Just... Oh, th that's great, Donet. Give them lots and lots of kisses from me. Yeah. Elena, I'm doing fine. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. I'm doing fine. And thank you so much for joining as well. Yeah. And so, like I was saying, the, this lead magnet, it doesn't matter what type of business you have, whether it's you are doing network marketing or you are a hairdresser or you are a plumber or you are dealing in cars or you are, um, whatever type of business you are doing online. It's very important to develop your list because your list is where you have your money. 
that is where you have your money so if you are if you are not developing your list if you are not building your list i would love for you to contact me and i'll take you step by step I will donate, definitely I will. I will give them lots of greetings from, from you. And I will take you step by step how you can start to create or build your list because it's very important for you to have a list, especially when you are marketing online. If you don't have a list, it will be difficult for your business to grow. Of course, it doesn't take a day or two, neither it doesn't come overnight, but gradually as you are doing the right thing, you will begin to notice that your business is growing slowly and steadily. So it is very important to learn this. And if you also want to learn how to do this, this lead magnet the, um, for your business, you can still you can contact me. Then I will definitely um, help you out. I will have to do a video about it, a sh screen sharing, so that you will see exactly what I mean about this. Yeah how to do that then i hope that will help you um, for your business but if you have any problem or you're stuck with in your business you don't know how to take it to the next level please contact me i will definitely hold your hand and give you a walk through how you can go through or how you can set goals to go through those barriers yeah so this is all I have for today. If you find value from this, I would love for you to share with your friends, your team members, your uh, um, business partners, your companies. And your, if you have a Facebook group, you share with your group or you share on your Facebook page or your Facebook profile. Anyhow, so that others can get, um, can get value from this because there are so many people Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. How are you this evening? Thanks for the like. You know, there are so many people um, that are going through a lot of problems, yeah? So they, they are also looking for such information like this, yeah? So please, I will appreciate it and they will appreciate if they get such information like this. So this is all I have for you today and I hope you've got value from this. And I will see you all tomorrow, same time, same place, Facebook Live. You all have a wonderful evening and bye for now.